A windy spring practice here for Texas Tech football. Day three in the books. I'm Taylor Peters with your Red Raider Report alongside head coach Cliff Kingsbury. Coach, a little bit of extra energy and excitement, though, as you guys finally able to get in pads for the first time here in spring ball. It's always a fun day. Um, the real players show up when you put the pads on. and I thought it was competitive. I, I thought it was physical defensively. It's good to see a lot of those guys back out here and offensively trying to figure out who's going to be the next guy to step up at some positions. Um, but it was productive, and we just got to get better moving into Thursday. So much of spring ball, though, is spent in the film room, the weight room, working with Miss Dana Nutrition, trying to get bigger and stronger. But how telling is a day like today when you're finally able to get them in a game type situation? The exciting part is, is the players that haven't played a lot, whether they've been behind really good players or they red shirt and then so you get to see guys perform at a high level um, that have just been scout team players and I think for coaches it's good to see those guys finally get out there get their opportunity to show what they can do. We've talked so much about the newcomers that you guys are expecting to come up this year but a lot of new coaches here on staff too how have you seen them just been able to sort of mold as you guys have progressed here in spring ball? It's been it's been fun to uh, you know show them how we do things and, and listen to how they've done things at other places we have some coaches have been at some really successful places and take ideas from them as well. So I, I like the staff. I think they've meshed well and um, all hard workers that are excited to be at Texas Tech. And finally, Coach, last week some of your players were able to go and visit a local elementary school and read to some kids. Why is that something that you guys sort of encourage that your players for, to do in the spring ball in the off season? Yeah, it's just such an incredible community. Um, I just want them to know how fortunate they are to be a part of this community and the community shows so much love to our program um, that it's good to give back and it's good for those older players to see just how much it means to those little kids um, to be there and, and show that they care and, and um, show up at their schools. Uh, it's just uh, a cool way to give back. Right, thanks so much, Coach.